What it do is show BZ to S-H-O-B-O-A-T and we got an update on the relationship of Blueface and Krishan Rock because there's always an update, you feel me? So before we get into the details, go ahead and hit the like button on this video, subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so you don't miss the next video. So a video went semi-viral recently of a guy trying to put his arm around Krishan Rock and she was kind of curving him. Now that guy is just not any guy. I know some people that aren't tapped in with the New York drill scene don't know who this guy is, but it's Dougie B. He's one of the lit young New York rappers, you feel me? So a lot of people saw this video and they thought, oh man, what is Blueface gonna say about this? And we got Blueface's reaction. Now to keep everything kosher, Dougie B actually reached out to Blueface first before anything might have been misconstrued. So Blueface shows the DM that he got from Dougie B and it says, yo gang, I apologize for that. I was just saying hi, feel me? I wasn't on no funny shit of trying to get up on her. Word, my fault big bro, keep getting money gang. And then Blueface responded back saying, I'm not tripping off that one. That one is fair game, little bro. Now, if that was Jaden Alexis, who is his original baby mother, I would be upset. I mess with multiple girls at a time, but I don't care for multiple girls at a time. P.S. She only acted like that because she ain't know you had status. If you was anybody else bigger, she would have been cool with it. I know this. And he does the handshaking emoji saying it's all good. So Blueface then goes on to put up a picture of his baby mama, Jade, and Alexis saying, the only female I'm currently possessive over right now, she only got one body her whole life, and you can't find her online with nobody else. What more can I ask for? Now, I know to some women, they might not get that, but fellas understand that 100%, and that starts to make things make a little bit of sense. You feel me? So now Blueface goes on to explain, if you really want to be player out here, Number one rule is to only have one number one rule. Always remember you can only care about one of your west sides. If you tripping off all of them, that's not player. That's tender. One at a time. Players need love at the end of the day from that one. Two and three is just for when you bored. And then Blueface goes into more detail on that. I'm going to drop the video right here. Check it out. All right, come and give you all some player tips. Now, if you're a true player, you gotta think of yourself as like a high school football coach. You feel me? You got three quarterbacks, of course. You got first string, second string, third string, main bitch, side bitch, and a confide bitch. You hear me though? Now, your main star player, that's the one you tripping over. That's the one you on her noggin. Like, I'm super real dear player out here, so you better not make the team look bad on the dead homies. Now, two. She just getting reps in, you feel me, just in case one go down or one don't make the team look good, you feel me, then you, hey, get out, the, get out, get out, get out right now, and you got to throw two in there. And then three is just like, you know, she just on the practice squad, you know, she, she, she could do whatever she want to do. You just confide in her, because one word about two and two word about one. Now, the depth chart could always change, baby, <clears throat> so play your position. Cause when it's your time to shine, you feel me? You better, you better do yours, cause I'ma do mine. I'm gonna skill yard. You feel me? Like, if one star, if the, usually the star player after a while, they get tired of being a star player. You know, they start checking out other schools and finding out, like, you know, they start showing up late to practice. And you feel me? That's when two step up. Like, oh yeah, you playing? You late? Oh, yeah, I'm on time. Yeah, yeah. Then you, you feel me? Then it's like, hey, you got to go with the with the best player, man. And, you know, your star player got to listen. Crip. Your first string got to be the best listener. Crip. That's all I can recommend. Because too many bitches will fuck you up, man. Don't get too many. And last but not least, you got to be a good coach. Got to be a good coach. You can't be player with no car, you can't be player with no house, you can't be player not taking care of your responsibilities, you feel me, because as a coach, you got to lead by example, you feel me, your star player lead the team, but you got to lead your star player to lead the team, you hear me, it's a pecking order, you feel me, not a Popeye's order, it's a pecking order, 
I don't feel you. So you got to be a good coach, man. You got to be an example. You got to be something like these bitches is looking at like, yes, sir. Sir, yes, sir. You feel me? Tell her, give me a lap right now. Sir, you, the bitch, bitch got to start running, cuz. And if she don't start running, yo, 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 coaching ain't, yo, coaching ain't running. Oh, man. <laughs> My coaching is running. I don't screw you. Our dead elbies by coaching is, what? I could take a bitch out the game, and she gonna sit on the sideline before she look at another team. And Jaden, she fuck bitches, so she she playing it smooth. She don't, I'm the only guy she's ever had sex with, but that's one thing she will do. She she fuck him up. She won't even fuck him with me either. She just fuck by herself. She don't like having threesomes with me. She like to fuck the hoes by herself. That's her little alter thing she do. Hey, I can dig it. I ain't mad at it. Just save a little p on the plate for me. Now for the ladies, sorry, girls ain't players too. Either ho a hoe or a housewife. That's it. <laughs> I didn't make this up. Don't be mad at Blue. Like, no, no. Girls can't be coached. Y'all, y'all got too much going on. Y'all, y'all could bleed for, for seven days straight and not die. That's crazy. That's crazy work. I don't know how that's possible, but it's possible. So, for the ladies, I suggest you pick the best coach because you're going to get played regardless. So, you either want to play for Notre Dame or you want to play for Blaine Junior College. You feel me? I don't know. I'm trying to give it to y'all straight like that. Because now, if you if you a female and you try to play the try to play the coach, you're gonna play yourself. You're gonna be single with, at 40 with no kids. Like, there's a lot of them right now who tried to play the coach. Look at them. Look at them. Or you're gonna be 40 with a bunch of kids and no, no man, no ring. So, I don't know, guys. Don't be mad at me. If a man can have 10 kids and still find a to marry him, you can't compete with that, ladies. You can't have 10 kids and find a good, substantial guy to marry you. I don't know why it's like that. Hey, I don't, it beats me. I just accept the game cut and I play it. So what do you guys think? Is Blueface making sense? Let me know what you think in the comments. As always, like the video, subscribe to the channel. Show BZ. I'm out.